What's up, ladies and gents? And if you're new to the channel, it's your boy Shaka Zulu, and I'm back here for another video. And today, guys, we're trying a black market brand, gang. So today, as you can tell by the title, yes, we're trying a new black market brand, or it's not even new. I think it's been out for a while, and they're trying to make their way into the game. Um, and the and you guys are probably like, why is he trying more black market and all this stuff? The reason why I'm trying more black market is because a lot of you guys. I'm not saying a lot of you guys, you know, shout out to the Zulu gamers, people that support me, but a lot of people got offended about the fry. They thought I was just, you know, talking out my ass. They thought that, um, that I was just trying to diss the product. If you guys watch the full product, I never, I mean, just cause I say it's fake doesn't mean, you know, it's necessary. I just say it's fake because it's a black market brand. You know what I'm saying? It could be real. But it definitely wasn't no live resin. That fried was definitely not no live resin. You know what I'm saying? That shit didn't taste right. Um, it did not taste right to me. And um, I, and I said that in the vlog, you know, it could be disty. It could be some disty, you know what I'm saying? But it's definitely not live resin. Um, and it just didn't taste right to me. So I got this brand and I actually got to talk to them on the phone. And they messaged me about it, like what the product is and all that stuff. Um, and they told me this is what they look like. They sent me like six fucking carts, guys. They dropped these off at, um, at my door, like six cartridges. Um, they're called Pac-Man, guys. Shout out to Pac-Man. We're gonna see if these taste good. And um, I had a conversation with them, like I said, and I was like, you know, I'm gonna be doing a real review. This is a real review. And he trusts, and he was like, yeah, I want you to do a real review i want your honest opinion and all that shit so we're gonna give him a real review an honest opinion and this is what he said i'm gonna show you guys what he said on instagram about the product he said it's a two gram liquid diamond live resin device one of the first ever to combine two different concentrates into one the purpose of this wasn't just the highest thc possible but the combination of multiple concentrates attacking the highest amount of cannabinoids for the psychoactive effect. So they mix like live resin and Disty together to make this product. Cause like usually when I hear liquid diamonds, it's usually like a Disty cart, high THC type thing. So it looks like they mixed a little bit of Disty and a little bit of live resin to make their product. All right. Packaging, I can't lie, is dope. It's not a bad looking packaging. It is, you know, the Pac-Man kind of makes it seem like it's fake, to be honest. It makes me more skeptical about this shit, but I got it from the source. They told me about it. I actually talked to them on the phone. They said it was Disty plus live resin, so we're gonna see what's popping. I think the strains that I wanna try today is Blueberry Diesel, it's a sativa. I'm gonna try that one. And then I'm going to also try Cereal Skunk. And I'm gonna try Cereal Skunk because I feel like Cereal Skunk might be more of on the dank side, more on the live resin. And then the, the Blueberry Diesel, maybe, uh, well it's Blueberry Diesel. It might be a little dank too, because it got that diesel in it. But at the end of the day, I think it's gonna be a little bit fruity because it's mixed with Disty. But, um, you know, I just was like, man, why not try it? I'm gonna just try it, see what happens, and I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion, you know what I'm saying? And I hope you guys, if you guys wanna try it or not, check out their Instagram. Um, I, I try, you know what I'm saying? I tried black market brands. The last black market brand I tried that was actually, you know, decent was Tiny. If you guys seen the two gram Tiny, that one was decent, but the fried was like, eh, I don't know about this. So we're gonna see about this pack, man. Um, but yeah, we had a conversation on the phone and he just said that it's just hard to get into the market and so you know there's you know most brands they just start out as a black market so you know at least the people are being honest with me and they're telling me what's in their product and then he also said if i wanted he could send me the lab results which i'm probably gonna hit him up soon and be like can i see the lab results and then i'm gonna let you guys also know about the lab results also um, if you guys are, are wondering, just hit me up and I'll try and contact them about the lab results. But let's check this bitch out, man. The packaging is on fucking hit, man. I can't fucking front. The packaging's on hit, bro. The packaging's on hit. I'm giving that. We're gonna try the blueberry diesel first. 
And I ain't gonna lie, when I first saw this shit, man, I was skeptical, because, you know, Pac-Man, Pac-Man, come on, man. If I saw this on, a, you know, if I saw this on Reddit, I'd be like, what the heck, man? But the battery looks cool. It's, you know, a regular micro. I don't think this is a Type-C. It might be a Type-C, I'm not sure. The battery looks cool. They got their own unique battery. I feel like a lot of brands, they get kind of the same batteries and they have their own unique battery. And then they actually have their Instagram on the back. So it looks like they're trying to be legit. So let's see, it says press button five times to turn on and off. All right. Ooh. Okay, see now this tastes real. This tastes real, man. Hold up. I fuck with it. It's not bad. If you guys can kind of see the oil. It's a little bit on the dark side. It's not too bad. It's a little light. It's a little like brownish color. It's not a bad looking color, but this shit tastes pretty good. It's more on the dank side, I would say. It definitely has that like diesel taste like that um you know what i'm saying you know them diesel strains it kind of has that diesel dank taste strain to it it's not bad it has a little fruitiness to it but you can barely notice it <coughs> but we're gonna see if this shit actually gets me high how the hype feels But the blueberry diesel does not taste bad, guys. The blueberry diesel doesn't taste bad. You know what I'm saying? It's not a bad taste. <coughs> if anything, I would just say, uh, I mean, it's two grams. You know, I just think it should be like less heat. I think all batteries just need less heat. This one needs less heat, man. Shit's burning hot. And I will say this thing has no light, so I don't even know if this thing has a blinker, so I'm not even gonna attempt a blinker on this. But that's a plus. The shit's not giving me a headache. The taste actually tastes like an actual, di it tastes more on the disty side. I don't really, you know, it's kind of dank, but it has that disty. I'm guessing that's the live resin in it and the live resin, the, the, the live resin terps that are in it. That's giving it that dankness. But you can also taste it. I feel like you could definitely taste the disty though too. It's like a hint of hint of sweetness. All right, let's try. The next one, and it's Cereal Skunk, bro. These names. That's so funny. And then I would also say, man, if the, you know, maybe put, like, the strains names that you actually use to make your product. You know what I'm saying? Like, Cereal Skunk is cool. But, you know, maybe tell us what you did to create Cereal Skunk. Like, what two strains you put together to create Cereal Skunk or something. But, you know... It's not a bad, I would say it's not too bad. It tastes better than the fry to me. The fry just tastes like Nick juice to me, man. This one actually tastes like actual disty, like actual, like, like a cartridge. You know what I'm saying? And the oil actually looks nicely dark. Even though it's a mix between the live resin and, you know, disty. But cheers, guys. And I like how they put like different fruit they got the blueberry on this one and then the cereal on this one you guys can't really see hold on there you go you guys can barely see it's like focus it's kind of small though so let's try this freaking cereal skunk see what it tastes like oh yeah 
okay, there is a light on the bottom. What? That's fucking sick. I didn't notice that. So there is a light on the bottom. The eyes, bro. That's hard, bro. All right, that's kind of hard. I'll give him that. I still would be. I still would question these, just because it's a black market brand, but it tastes pretty decent. But the lights, the eyes light up. You know what I'm saying? The eyes at the bottom of the Pac-Man on here, they light up. Let me see if I can show you guys real quick. Get a quick zoom. But the eyes light up, guys. You guys can kind of see it. I'm trying not to, you know, because I'm not hitting it. But cheers, guys. Okay. All right, the cereal skunk. And I'm starting to feel the high now. It's getting me more of like a head high. The high's not too bad. At least it's not like not a headache, bro. You know what I'm saying? Um, the taste on this one now, I'm not digging the taste on this one. I don't know, it tastes like, I don't know, like a, It has a dank taste to it, but it also has like this butterscotch tasty taste to it, like like that I don't like. I don't know what they they use, but it just you know it has like a butterscotchy taste to it. I'm not really digging it, but I do dig this fucking the blueberry diesel. We might we're gonna try try more for sure. I'm probably gonna get a couple more vlogs in with this one. We're gonna see what's popping. We got four more pretty much to try, so I might do more vlogs and check it out in the coming weeks. But these two, I would say, I'm probably not gonna smoke the cereal skunk as much, just because I don't, you know, the taste is not there, but the blueberry diesel's not too bad, you know? Blueberry diesel's not bad. It's decent, decent tasting. Decent tasting. It's definitely got a dank side to it for sure. Now I wanna try the other ones for sure, for sure. So we're gonna definitely try every single one of these and I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion. If you guys wanna check them out, I'll put their Instagram in the comments. You guys know the vibes, man. More videos to come, guys, man. But I just wanted to try this guys for you. But on the scale of one to 10, I would say the highest chill it got me a cool high. I feel like I'm like an actual weed high and it feels like I'm like at like a cool eight right now off those hits. So I'm just relaxing. Probably go cook something to eat after this. But this definitely has like a skunky taste to it. This blueberry diesel, it's like a skunky taste. Like a skunk dank taste, if you guys know what I'm saying. But I hope everyone's having a good day either way, guys, man. Whatever you guys are doing out there, I hope you guys are having a good day. Remember to eat, breathe, smoke, weed, more vlogs to come. I just wanted to make a quick little review for you guys and show you guys some black market brands. Should you trust this? I don't know, it's up for you guys to really decide. I mean, I would still be very precautious about trying a black market brand, but this one seems cool, seems kind of real. You know what I'm saying? I got to talk to the company, they seem kind of cool. This one tastes all right. I still want to try the other ones until I get my real, real honest opinion if I want to smoke these still. But, you know what I'm saying? For now, I would say I'd give it like a good, I'd give it like a good, like a six. I'd give it like a six. You know what I'm saying? Cause you know, I feel like not every, I mean, some brands, it just depends on the brand, but a lot of brands, when they make the Disney stuff, it's like a hit or miss because of the Terps and stuff like the taste. It's It all comes down to the taste and the high. This high is pretty good though, I ain't gonna lie. I'm actually getting higher now, fuck. Yeah, it's not a bad high, bro. It's not a fucking bad high. It's just that the taste, you gotta just, you know, it's about perfecting the taste, I feel like a lot. 
with a lot of these Disney type brands and stuff, even though this is a little bit different because it's a mixture of both. And they're actually saying that it's a mixture of both, um, which is cool, man. But I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog, man. Remember to eat, breathe, smoke weed. We're going to be back for more videos soon. Peace out, gang. Stay